1105 on this Thursday night, May 8th, 2014 on a Thursday night. Time now for what a magician PJ Wayne's the late night report. Thursday night, May 8th, 2014. Good evening, everybody. Our current conditions at 11 o'clock in North Massachusetts, 56 degrees with clear skies, humidity 4%, with speed 3 miles per barometer. Wind direction 240 miles per hour, which is to the southwest and dew point about 51 degrees, visibility of 10 miles. Okay, let us take a look at our radar scope, and it shows a couple of extras of rain shots from western Vermont into Massachusetts, up in and upstate New York, down for western Quebec. Stretching out for seven Ontario and, and some sleeting around western Michigan and our showers and thunderstorms from eastern Dakotas. And stretching out for North Central Minnesota down for Wisconsin and stretching out for Iowa down for the Mississippi Valley and down for seven Texas and Northern Mexico. A couple of bad terrain shots in southwestern portions and western portions of Kansas down for southeastern portions of Colorado. Sleeting snow shots in north central portions of Colorado and down for west central portions of Wyoming. Rain shots in Northern California and Nevada and up in western Idaho down for Oregon and Washington down for British come down Alberta and down for Saskatchewan with some sleeting snow shots mixing in from the uh, Olympics in Cascade Mountains in Washington, Oregon here. Dodge City, Kansas. Good evening. 55 degrees with clear skies. Yeah. Dodge City, Kansas. And some snow flows around no Mexico here. Turn it on and out. Suddenly a little beer and it shows. A couple of extra spots covering much of southern Maine down for much of New England and covering New York City down Pennsylvania and stretching up to Western New England. So as we head toward the Quebec, coming to much of Montreal and searching out for the Great Lakes and out for Mississippi Valley and down through the, the, end of the commute, Gulf States and out for Eastern Texas and out for Mexico. And now we're back to from Colorado and Western Kansas up into Nebraska and out for the Dakotas and Minnesota up into Southern Manitoba. And a couple of batch spots covering California and Nevada down Western Utah and up into Idaho, Oregon, Washington, down for British Columbia and down for Western Alberta. And up to Alaska. Here and up to see here. Oh, hey, let us take a look at our map situation here. Cold front from northwestern California and western Oregon, and, and a pink front off the British Columbia coast. And a warm front from southwestern Washington here. Station front from Alberta, down from central Montana and Wyoming, and down from Colorado. And a cold front from northeastern New Mexico. Such on northern Texas and Oklahoma, Kansas, and up in Iowa. Warm front from Minnesota and north central Wisconsin. And station front from Michigan, down from Ohio, down from Pennsylvania, and at the sea here. And front by from west central Oklahoma, down from Denver, Texas, and north central Mexico. Front by from southern New Hampshire and coastal Maine, and up to New Brunswick here. And front by from north central Minnesota, and up to the western portions of Ontario. What about from Southern Nevada and southeastern portion of California? Low pressure in Arizona, New Mexico, Northern Texas, and Northern Mexico, and Southern Minnesota, and high pressure in Northern Utah and Manitoba. Here, 61 degrees at temperature in Boston, and 72 in Washington, D.C., 77 in Atlanta, 80 in Miami, 77 in Brownsville, 66 in Dallas, Texas, 71 in Kansas, 82 in Chicago, 58 in Minneapolis, 42 in Denver, 57 in Salt Lake City, 59 in Albuquerque, 57 in Great Falls, 54 in Seattle, 63 in San Francisco, and 61 in Los Angeles. Here. Tonight, what am I like? Low clouds of fog linger mainly south of the mass track. Low visibility and hazardous driving for the south coast. Scattered showers available in late tonight ahead of the slowly approaching warm front, especially west continuing front the late afternoon with a low probability of a late day thunderstorm. Friday will be a cool day with highs in the 50s, low 60s. Warm front lips for the middle of the region overnight. Low clouds, pressure fog, and scattered showers, and actually thunderstorms moves west east south across southern New England and turning breezy warm with on Saturday with highs in the 70s with afternoon showers and thunderstorms. There. And national forecast here. These are severe thunderstorms. Okay, tomorrow's forecast here. Severe thunderstorms possible from northern Louisiana down for North Eastern Texas down for Arkansas down for Western Mississippi, Tennessee, and Kansas down for Southern Indiana and Southern Illinois and Missouri. And some rain thunderstorms up in Canada and rain in. Maine and coastal Canada air and rain stretching around much of the northeast and in upstate New York, Pennsylvania, and stretching around much of the eastern portion of the region, and no preservation in Florida. And raining for much of the Pacific Northwest for a couple of batches of snow in the Mountains of Oregon and Washington and the Yellowstone Mountains here. In the video, a student throws a chair at the teacher. That teacher was then disciplined for not Let's take a look at our school bus forecast here. 7 a.m., 52 degrees of cloud skies, and 2 p.m., 61 degrees of fear shower. Okay, let's take a look at our fort. A special committee to investigate the deadly terrorist attack in Benghazi. 
That vote was nearly along party lines, with just seven Democrats joining Republicans to vote in favor. Four Americans, including Winchester native Glenn Doherty, were killed in the 2012 assault by terrorists associated with Al-Qaeda. You know I'm not a racist. You don't think that. That's the likeness and the voice of Clifford's owner Donald Sterling on the defensive amid allegations of racism. This certifies the lip off as... Okay, let's take a look at our deck cam here. And it is a cloudy and a little foggy night on tap. And an overnight hours for tonight and continue tomorrow. Wait, right, let's take a look at our seven day forecast. It goes like this. I was thinking of doing the temperatures, but the, in the way that's not working, so sticking with what I got. Okay! For the bow! Wait, sleep it all night out of the night. Part got to be followed by Clouds got to be low about 40 degrees. Wind stuff is about 5 to 10 miles far. For Friday, we're going to see some afternoon showers later in the day with some few showers available later night. High about 62, low about 53 degrees. Wind stop, east to the south, south is about 10 to 50 miles per hour. For Saturday, scattered showers, high is 73, low about 58 degrees. And Sunday, parts cross skies with a high about 60, low about 53 degrees. And for Monday, a few showers, high in 79, low about 55 degrees. Here, for Tuesday, cloud skies high about 72, low about 50 degrees. And Wednesday, cloud skies high about 67, low about 54 degrees. For Thursday, cloud skies high about 68, low about 53 degrees. For next Friday, showers high about 66, low about 49 degrees. And for Saturday, rain high 65, low about 47 degrees. Peters, what a phrase of the night! A uh, showery Friday on tap. This is BJ with you for a good night with a good vibe tonight. We'll be seeing you tomorrow morning. Good night!